welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Courtney and I am so excited that you are here today. It has been a minute. I'm sure you can tell I'm a little bit sick. The last month my family has been sick. I was traveling for work. I got home. I got sick. I've been sick for a little bit, but it's time to get back into filming. So today I thought we would do a Beautylish lucky bag unboxing. I received both the extra large and the large. One was gifted, one was purchased. And um, yeah, I am late to the game on uploading this, but I thought it would be good to get this up, get back into the routine of filming. And if you're not familiar, the Beautylish Lucky Bag is a mystery bag that launches each year the day after Christmas and then ships sometime in January. It is a mystery bag. You purchase it for $150 plus shipping and taxes, and then you are supposed to receive over $300 worth of product from Beautylish. No Jeffree Star is in here or Wayne Goss. Those are separate boxes, but we'll go ahead and get right into it and see what I received. Each year, an artist will create the paper that you see here. You get a little gift tag. It gives you like a good luck message, a happy year message, um, and it lets you know that this is the Lucky Bag 2024. So when I open up the box, I take out the black paper here, black paper, and then inside. I'll try my best to make this as much of a mystery as possible. But you do get a bag with all of your items. I do see something in here that I already have, and I'll do my best to kind of give you the prices along the way, and then at the very end, we will add everything up. So, get my calculator up and running. Let's get onto the Beautylish website, which I already have stuff in my cart. And then I do have something that I already own here, but that's okay because I also like to gift some of these items. So first item that I see in here is the Natasha Denona Yucca Palette. This is like the green gold palette. It is the midi size. So there's the midi palette. And there's the shape that you get inside. And then of course with Natasha Denona, you get a gorgeous big mirror. This has a protector over it. I'm gonna close that and keep it as is because I will likely gift this to my sister or somebody that I work with. This does retail for $69. So we'll add that to the calculator here. Next item that I'm pulling out. Oh, nice, I've never received something like this. So I have received these multiple years. Um, is the Dr. Barbara Strum Super Anti-Aging Shampoo. So let's see. This is Molecular Hair and Scalp Restore and Repair. All right, this is a $60 um, shampoo. It says, rich shampoo is ingredient science rich hair wash specifically formulated to boost shine, suppleness and volume in lifeless, dull looking and aging hair. Gentle shampoo has oat, candle bush, a bunch of other antioxidant rich extracts to help strengthen the scalp, B5, all of that, UV protection. So a really pricey shampoo, little bottle, $60 is what that retails for on Beautylish right now. And then moving along, it looks like I got quite a bit of like skincare stuff or hair care. I got the R & Co Sleep Mask Night Repair Serum. And this says luxurious overnight serum um, repairs parched damaged hair. So this is a hair sleeping mask, R and Co. I should have known R and Co blue. Wow. Okay. This is a $165 hair mask night repair serum. Yeah. $165. All right. So we are already almost at the $300 mark with just those three items. Um, I likely will never repurchase that mask, but I'm excited to try it. It does say it helps um, with parched damaged hair while you sleep, green caviar, algae rich in um, oligolaments, vitamins and minerals helps nourish, rebuild, and revitalize hair, leaving it shiny, smooth, healthy, strong. Reduces frizz, overnight repair, and overnight um, split end repair. 
So $165 mask. <laughs> you get two ounces. Next up is, oh, I have a sample of this. I um, haven't tried it yet, but I have wanted to. The Danessa Myricks Yummy Skin Blur Tint. Sorry, Glow Serum, not Blur Tint. The Glow Serum from Danessa Myricks. I absolutely love the Danessa Myricks Yummy Skin um, Tint. So I'm very excited to have this because I was very, very um, happy with that product. This is the light to medium with a radiant finish in the shade Main Squeeze. This is 30, a $34 um, glow serum. I will definitely be keeping this. Rich priming serum with radiant glow boosting finish. Let's take a look at that here. Everything will be linked down below if you have any interest in potentially purchasing anything. Get this little squeezy tube. Again, this is in the shade Main Squeeze. I like that it has like a flat base here on the lid and then just rub that in here. Very moisturizing feeling, very glowy. I'll definitely have to compare it to the Charlotte Tilbury Beauty Light one, but you can see it reflecting from my light here. And a really nice, like, clean fragrance on that. So that is $34. And then next up, I have the Good Molecules Yerba Mate Wake Up Eye Gel. Good Molecules is a brand um, from Beautylish or like a house brand for them. So it's typically a more affordable brand. And this is um, $6 for this Yerba Mate Wake Up Eye Gel. So that is a $6 product. Again, that's a more affordable line with Beautylish, and I believe it's a house brand for them. Very excited about this. I'm definitely feeling like this is a very lucky bag. I didn't realize that the hair mask would be $165, but I also got a Sonia G brush. This is the Sonia G Jumbo Worker brush. I cannot remember if I, I don't think I have the Jumbo Worker. I have the Jumbo Base and another one of these, maybe the Fusion Eye Worker. Cannot remember, but I love Sony G brushes. I get scared to use them because I don't want to ruin them. I think I have the Fusion Eye. No, I don't, that's what this is, the Jumbo Worker. Okay, so this is um, $38 for this brush. Again, very happy with getting one of these here in my bag. So $38 Fusion Eye Jumbo Worker. Get a good concealer brush too. Alrighty, and while I did not get the Wayne Goss bag, I did get a Wayne Goss lipstick. So this is the Wayne Goss lipstick in the shade Dahlia. I have one of his other shades. It's a little too peachy for me and I had it, got it in another um, Beautylish bag. It might actually be this shade. <laughs> Um, it looks very, very peach, very orange on me, but there is this shade. Maybe I'll gift it to my mom or my sister since I just swatched it, family member. Um, but this is the Luxury Cream Lipstick, and I want to say these retailed at one point for like $30. Let me take a look here and see. His line is getting a complete revamp if you haven't watched his video, but $28, so close. $28 lipstick here, so let me throw that into the calculator. Alrighty, next up is a Viseart palette, a little Petite Four palette in the shades Water Lotus. So a little tiny quad. I love these little quads. They're great for travel. Really small, fit in the palm of your hand. And I like Viseart's formula. But this is, let me take that little, the Water Lotus palette. Very out of my comfort zone, but let's take a look and swatch. Might be fun. Some minty shades here. This is over that glow serum, so they stuck a little bit. But here is all four shades. Got some really pretty shimmers. 
So there is the Viseart Petite Palette. And again, that's in Water Lotus and that's $25. These are also super affordable um, for somebody that wants some fun colors, but you don't want like a giant palette or maybe you want more than like a single shadow. Really good price for four and there's like 18, 20 of these little petite spores. So yeah, this is the Water Lily. And again, that was $25. All right, next up, Susan Kaufman Body Butter. So we have a big giant body butter here. I am not familiar with this brand at all. Um, and I don't see it even listed on the brands on Beautylish. Okay, here we go. Wow, okay. This is a $75 um, body butter. I have not watched anybody else's um, videos, but you get a nice glass jar, plastic lid, sealed. Seems like it smells good. A little sick. Let's see. Shea butter, olive oil, vitamin E, doesn't say it has a fragrance. Probably just the shea butter that I'm smelling through that here. Um, suitable for dry skin, knees and elbows, several times in the day, suitable even for babies. So $75 body butter here. And then I think one more item in my bag. Yes, there's always some sort of little like scrunchy hair tie thing, so some kitsch. Scrunchies, if I had to guess, these are like probably eight bucks. Let's take a look. $12, two pack, olive green and black. I love these colors actually. So you get all those items. I paid $155, $150 I think with tax and shipping is $165. And my box was valued at $512. So most expensive items were the Natasha Denona palette, which I'd be super excited about if I didn't already have it. Um, the super anti-aging shampoo, the sleep mask and the body butter. So um, several non makeup items, which is actually okay with me. I have a lot of makeup, so it's fun to get something different, but $512 is the retail value of my box. Um, again, I paid 165 ish. So I got about $347 more um, product than what I paid for, if you like to think of it that way. Everything will be linked down below if you're interested in checking anything out. Let me know down below if you got a lucky bag and what you got, and if you think this was a lucky box or not. Thanks so much, everybody. I will see you in my next video. Bye.